bad strapping there was the surfboard but surfers got kind of tired for waiting for the big waves so somebody no one knows who slapped a piece of board onto some roller skates and a new fad was born but pretty soon the skateboard moved off the beach and onto the city streets and before you knew it manufacturers were making the first commercially produced skateboards by 1965 skateboarding was a full-fledged fad international skateboard championships were held in anaheim california johnny carson learned to skateboard on the tonight show and the eiffel tower was declared off limits to skaters in Paris. But then suddenly, it all disappeared. Skateboards were yesterday's fad that nobody wanted. Nobody except the serious skaters who started skateboarding in empty swimming pools. But when plastic urethane roller rink wheels were added to skateboards, the skateboarding craze was born again. And here to accept the golden gizmo for skateboarding, the world's greatest freestyle skater, Rodney Mullen! Rodney! Show, buddy. Rodney, Rodney, um, I'm a skater myself. I'm such a tremendous fan of yours. Give me some tips on uh, skateboarding. Uh, the first thing you should do is get some good knee pads. Yeah. And um, like the ones you have on. Yeah, it's important. Knees go first. Um, uh, let it be your own thing, and also make up your own style. Right. And people, they tend to take it too seriously. Once mm -hmm. they decide they want to be good, just keep having fun. And it's a fun sport, and to have fun with it, then you get good. Right, that's the only way. Okay, Rodney, can you rip it up here? Yeah. Woo!